hey guys how are you hopefully you guys are doing well so today's video i'm just gonna do get ready with me and so let's go ahead and get ready and if you have or if you're wanting to get ready with me go ahead pull up whatever you have let's just chit chat and get ready i'm like nowadays not in a mood of like doing makeup or buy any products because what i have showed you guys my past videos pretty much all my products that i bought it's pretty new and i keep buying it like keep on buying it buying products makeup products i mean and i am like getting overwhelmed with uh, stuff that i have and i accumulated as you probably can see those are like most of my skin cares how much can i go through you know they will expire and they expire and i have to like literally throw money in the trash other stuff that you probably cannot see that one of those and there's another one those uh plastic drawers i have two of these the other one is over here so those are full of makeups and i also have one that's right here with me here those are like my current ones that like i'm into and i'm using so i have a lot i'm like i know i love makeup i've always loved makeup and i've always like collected them but as i'm growing older i feel like i'm getting away from makeup as much i am like literally happy with the way i feel you know and i don't want to cake up and i don't want to have extra layers of product all I want is my lash to just have lashes, like look like I do have lashes. I like to just put a little bit of mascara. Sometimes I don't even put mascaras. I just curl my lashes and I go with my days. And then I would do my skincares. And for the most part, I would like to put my SPF. And the SPF has uh, the glow, which is a uh, super good glow screen. And it does give you that uh, kind of a little bit tint with the glow. I would use that. And then eyebrow, I'll fix that. Sometimes I won't even do it. And or like I would just fix my hair and put on a rings, uh, earrings. And then that's all. If we go to dinner or lunch, I just I'm speaking what I'm feeling right now. You know what I'm saying? And on top of it, whatever is going on with around us you know this whole situation crazy happening so moods are just in a different place you know it's, with all that being said it doesn't feel sometimes it to me i'm not talking for anybody else but for me it doesn't feel right let me go ahead and start my makeup you know as i'm like i'm gonna try to go do my makeup today at least just so you know i already used this one this morning so i'm not gonna use anything else on uh but i'm just gonna use up uh, i'm not gonna do anything else meaning the prep so i'm just gonna use this one tusha claw from ysl and this one is the uh the little gold reflex thingy and i like to use this one so i'm just gonna put it in right here the moods are in a different place right now this is why i had to sit down today and okay i was gonna just talk to you guys talk to my friend right and also curl my lashes eyebrow it is what it is and fix my hair and that's it that's all i do nowadays i'm not very into makeup that's why i haven't done makeup videos or like what's new blah blah, blah. because there hasn't been there has been a new products but the new product hasn't got my interest so i'm like not interested even purchasing because what i have here i'm in love and i probably will make a video of ranking all my stuff what i have and what i have returned and on top of it sephora is having a uh, spring event coming up i believe it's on april 2nd i might be wrong if not it is true for a vib uh, clients or members it starts uh uh, what is it april 2nd i'll have the picture right here on the screen so you'll see it although alta is having their 50 percent off but anything that is 50 percent is not what i want to buy and i really don't want to buy because it's on sale i don't have to have them with buying all that throughout the whole year and last year 
I'm good. So I bought some stuff like essential from Target. When I was at Target, I bought these earrings along with this. I bought a bunch of other earrings. That's like a hoop like. And let me show you. This video is actually really uh, get ready and chit chat for real. So this is uh, what I bought and um, these chunky earrings, hoops kind of earrings. So I bought these stuff and then also I bought um, this one right here, this little pearl one. It was different. So I thought to go ahead and get this one with the pearl, if you can see. Uh, this is what it looks like. So, you know, I could have done like a, I bought stuff from Target, what's new. I didn't just wanted to do that because I mean, it was just a boring stuff, you know, it's not anything that wow. And uh, so I thought, mm, what's the point of uh, showing? So here I am just sharing with you what I got from uh, Target as well for my earrings. So I like bought this one, the Cabinet Quan, and this is my shade is uh, SX03. Love this one. And it's very, very pigmented. You can use this thingy. It's a small, but don't be discounting because it's a small uh, product. And how much do you get? It's a thick consistency. As you can see, it's a thick cream foundation. And you just need barely little. You can use this one as your foundation, spot concealing, or concealer under the eye. But do not put too much if you are looking to buy this one this one will last you for i mean literally you can make like three regular foundation like this out of this little jar take a little bit off and make your own diy with the serum or oil foundation from this little pot so yeah i have this one and then this is the old one this uh nars and i have uh, what is it? Uh, the medium for Barcelona Sheer Glow. So I absolutely love this one. And then recently uh, when I uh, ordered some stuff from Sephora, uh, they had a little offer. So I got a, another Barcelona medium for, and this one is the light reflection foundation, the new one that they have. So I bought or I got this one as a sample and so I bought I got two of them so what I did is I used this one a little bit and I didn't see much different uh, between the sheer one and uh, this one right here so I just poured that into this foundation to mix it up a little bit so make my own cocktail foundation I guess and use this new one the Barcelona uh, NARS so yeah, and um, how are you guys doing? And like, how's everything going with you guys? Uh, let's chat on a comment, you know? I'd like to know you guys. Just comment, let me know how are you guys doing. And uh, my brush for my uh, foundation I'm using is from uh, Ed Cosmetics. Um, she comes up with this brushes every like I believe it's on uh, every around Valentine's Day. If you're looking to buy this shape type of brush, um, go to Ulta and ask them when it's released or if they have one available because that's where I bought this from. This is how it looks like. I want a little more coverage. I don't know where is this glitter coming from? Do I have glitter in here? It's all over my face. Very nice. Well, it is what it is. Yeah, I want to put a little more on. I just put on uh, my concealer. So this is the concealer I put. I'm not seeing much difference between um, like using my concealer, like I mentioned on my Clay de uh, Po concealer video that I would give you guys a update. I have not seen nor I have wear my uh, foundation as much or the concealer, I mean. So I'm not really a big fan of that concealer, especially with the price. I mean, you can buy better concealer than that. So I would say if you can pass, pass on it. And if you're absolutely in love with that uh, concealer and want to purchase it, then go for it. But they have a very bad shade range. 
they need to fix their shade range. I don't understand what these, um, you know, expensive bougie company, why don't they have like better shade range? I don't understand that. You know, their color, like let it be Chanel, Clay de Poe, by Terry, and even sometimes Tom Ford and La Mer, stuff like that. It's not that great of, you know, choice of uh, their foundation range. They don't have a good uh, choice of their concealer range. It's just four, 10, five, you know, that, that's all. We're in a 2022 people. I mean, we need to have a variety of colors. Look at Fenty, look at Rare Beauty, and look at Pat McGrath, look at um, even Charlotte, you know? She, they all have so many colors, variety of the foundation range, concealer almost. So I don't understand why Chanel, La Mer, Tom Ford sometimes, you know, like uh, Clay de Po by Terry, they don't decide to do this. Even Dior does it better, at least, you know? So I don't understand sometimes. I'm gonna go ahead and use my Lancome. This one is my oldie but goodie. It's a photogenic, what is this one called? Translucent powder. Using my little spongy here. This one I bought it from Amazon. So, and it's a obviously triangle puff. And I just get a little bit on here and go right there in the corner. This is perfect because you know, this angle right there just gives me perfect to go underneath my eyes. Sometimes the small things makes you like think, why didn't I think about that? And even if I did, why didn't I just come up with that? Make my own, you know, pop. <laughs> All right, so now that my under eye is set, use my Rare Beauty. I have the Always Sunny. I'm just gonna put it right here and right here. And thinner my nose right here. <laughs> Today I just want to do something different. I've not done this for a while. So I wanted to get my powder and powder like right here to chisel my jaw. And I am like one of those person who doesn't do these kind of stuff. And I kind of want to today, you know, I just want to see because I've seen several other ladies who does that and it looks so beautiful on them, like it chisel their jaws and everything. And I've always wanted to do this, but it's just not my cup of tea, you know, I don't do this. So I'm just going to let it sit there and brush it off later. Now I want to use my favorite and as everybody's it's always sold out I just that part it bothers me but I want to use the Charlotte Tilbury Pinkasm I almost didn't want to purchase this one but I got sucked into it because when it was available um, it sent me sent me a notification so I bought it and immediately next day it was sold out again people chill man it is not that important to have although i'm saying this you know i'm saying this but i bought it too so i guess everybody and their mother thought the same way <laughs> as i am this product right here was like because of it sold out because of a TikTok. whoever came up with the video and it sold out after that and then madison ray she did a little post or a video post that how she does her makeup and she used this product. This product sold out, you know? And brush this off and make sure it doesn't look like I have fine. Like I know it's, I wanna look like chisel, but then at the same time, I don't wanna look like too obvious. You know, I just wanna have a good makeup day. I'm gonna uh, put my highlighters on. This is the Chanel. This one is called Metal Peach. It's the limited edition one. It's so beautiful. Although after the pinkasm, you really don't need 
another like highlighter because that has the glow but I'm always extra see how beautiful this thing is love it alrighty so now for my eyes what do I want to do kind of want to keep it simple but then I want to do something different I am like tempted to use Charlotte Tilbury's uh, what is this one instant look of love in a palette I have both of the shade I have the darker and the lighter so I'm like between using I don't know which one pretty blush beauty which is a natural one uh, but then at the same time I am like wanting to use something different maybe I should use this Natasha Denona Metropolis uh, palette right here so what I did is I have few the shades I arranged it they were scattered everywhere I put all I popped them out and then I put the neutral shades on the side and all the like uh, darker greenish shades on this side so that's how I arranged my rearranged my um, shadows here. So if you have a palette, the same palette, and you're like, okay, that doesn't look like what I have because the shades were all scattered everywhere. So I just popped it out and I put it the way I feel like I want this shades to go. So you can do that if you want to. That's something, you know. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and use this palette. I also want to have a pink lips, so I'm not sure which, uh, what I want to do. Like, I just want to keep natural, but a little warmth, if that makes sense. Maybe I should just keep it natural and have a cat eye eyeliner and pink lipstick. How about that? I haven't done cat eyes like eyeliner for a while so here I am just using any kind of brown shades you know now that nowadays that we have thousands of these brown shades and even if you don't it's so easy to find these kind of shades you don't have to have exactly the same palette for <clears throat> for you to you know, use your uh, makeup for you to have a makeup done. Just grab from any palette, as long as they're pigmented and workable, then just grab that and uh, do your makeup, you know? I will not encourage you to go ahead and break your bangs to get expensive items i know i do have videos done people who are looking to buy it for them i would give them a thumbs up or down tell them what my feelings towards but that doesn't mean i'm asking you to you know go ahead and like forget about everything else and your priorities and go get that palette we have tons of stuff nowadays makeup wise and everything else wise so um you don't have to have the same exact thing unless you are already looking forward to buy it or you already have it or you really want it things like that you know just because i'm showing you doesn't mean i'm asking you or telling you you should buy it yes it is a bougie and luxury and nice thing to have but that i'm not gonna encourage anyone unless you think you want to and do I recommend this? Yes, definitely. I love this palette. But do you have to have it right at this moment or you want it? Like I'm asking you, you better run and get go get it. No, no, girl. Do your priorities, whatever it, it is, then the palettes and eyeshadows and makeups, you know. Um, you know better your situation, but I'm not telling you what to do. I'm just having the conversation like a friend's two friends. Sometimes I need somebody to like, wake me up, like say, hey, not buying everything is gonna do it, uh, solve your problem, save money. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go ahead and darken up my outer corner and I'm getting this olivey shade. Uh, a little bit of that also to deepen up my outer V or U, whatever you wanna call this thing right here, the carb. Sometimes I wanted to put like a heavy 
lashes on, but it feels like so weird. It looks so beautiful, but then it doesn't feel like it's me. It looks beautiful though, don't get me wrong. I love the look. I I see like a lot of uh, girls that they wear long lashes. They look so gorgeous and I, I feel like I wish I could pull that, but I mean, it would look pretty, but I don't just, I just, I just don't like that, you know, big boom lashes. You know, it's just not my personality. What do I want to do? I want a little bit of shimmer, a little bit of shimmer, like this sparkly one right here. Ah, that is actually a lot of shimmers. It's pretty but the reason why i don't like this kind of like sparkly items because it falls onto your face and it gets everywhere i don't like that i don't like that now i'm gonna use this like champagne-y shimmery thing it's not a glitter it's a shimmer there's a difference between both this one like this product right here as it looks like it's not but it is glitter kind of like very tiny glitters this one's a shimmery. So I'm going to go ahead and use my glam palette again from Natasha. And I have to have these inner corner line or the inner corner, what you call this uh, shadow, which is almost the same thing, is it? This one right here is a golder color, goldier, gold, whatever. And the inner corner from glam palette is more uh, champagne. Yeah, but... This is the Glam palette. This one's from the gold one is from the green palette. So I'm going to use the Glam palette and do ooh, this thing is so soft. Put it in a corner right here. I just want that pop. So for my eyeliner, I'm going to use Natasha Denona Micro Tech Eye Crayon and brown right here. Brown would look much softer and elegant so i'm just gonna pull my eye and do this all right so i like to do half um, liners. I don't like to drag it here. Even if I do, it's going to be very thin and will wing in this corner. So outer corner wings, inner corner wings. You see this right here in the corner? Right, so that's how I like my eyeliner to look like. I'm going to go ahead, curl my lashes and put mascara and I'll be right back. See the difference uh, with lashes on? I mean, it transformed the entire look, right? So what I did was or is um, I used this one from Lancome. This is the uh, Curls Boosting XL and this is a primer. So primer meaning if you don't know. It's a white mascara primer first, just like any other primer. And then I went with the Hypnose Drama Lancome again, and of, of course in a black. And this is the brush that bristles looks like. Love it. And this is what it looks like on my lashes, my wonky lashes. And then after that, I put this KKW beauty i bought this like i don't know when uh pink to this lip liner right here i'm kind of tempted between using the kkw pink to as lipstick as uh the pink one right here which is perfect for the lip liner but on top of it probably i'm gonna go with the angel from oh it smells so good um at least for me um I'm gonna go with this uh, Huda Beauty Angel right here on top of it. Most likely that's what I wanna do. Now I wanna put this on top of it. This one's from 
by makeup by mario bear glow and this one just gonna give me the glow pretty much which really don't need it but so this is what i'm saying like when you i'm not trying to like brag about saying this but when you collect so much makeup you just keep on tap topping everything up you know not necessarily you really need it you're just basically wasting it i mean do i really need to have all these on my lips not really but since i have it and i'm using it it's okay i could have just got away with using these two i really didn't need that or i, I could have just used this and put a lip liner and use this and color good I mean, it's good to have these, but since I have it, I'm just using it. I'm talking to myself right now, basically letting myself know that, girl, stop, pause. You don't need so much makeup right now. Use what I have and be happy. Just use it from my stash. Do not need to constantly buy it unless it's like something extra and I don't have it and looks beautiful, gorgeous, collection pieces, stuff like that. But beside that, I'm okay. I'm gonna go ahead and set my makeup using the Tatcha Luminous, or what is this one? Luminous Dewy Skin. Has been a while. I haven't used this. Do I need any more luminosity on my face? No, I don't, but use it like you know. Little extra. All right, so I am done with my makeup. I'm just gonna put on the piece of jewelry. And I did a tutorial on this hair, like, um, I did a treatment, oil treatment on my uh, hairs and uh, left it on for a night, overnight. And then I used the T3 new, like the air wrap kind of a thing. I don't know what's it called, like the exact name. But I used the barrel, the big barrel to give me the salon blowout. And that tutorial is coming. So please don't forget to subscribe before you leave so that you can um, you know see whenever I upload and we can chit chat I forgot to mention I used uh, the Huda Beauty this one number eight uh, for my eyebrow so forgot to mention about that so yeah basically my makeup is done thank you so much for hanging out with me and listening to my whatever you know it's just had to share with somebody my friend i consider you guys my friend i'm loving the lips i'm awake and i'm spring-like you know so yeah i hope to catch you on my next video hopefully and don't forget to subscribe once again before you leave i will see you very soon on my next video you guys don't forget to take care of yourself and stay happy and healthy bye now